All right, chapter three, anten uh, microwave antennas. Navy Electricity Electronic Training Series Module 11 Microwave Principles NAVEDTRA 14183. Distribution approved for public relations distribution unlimited. Microwave antennas. Upon completion of the, each of the sections of the student will be able to explain the basic character of the couple of directives, the reciprocity and efficiency of the microwave antennas described with the construction basic theory of the operation reflector antennas, born or eight years. Displaying construction operation microwave landing uh, antennas described the construction theory of the operation driven the parasitic antenna arrays to explain the basic operation apl application frequency sensitivity antennas. All right, introduction. The, in this chapter, you will stay with the general character of the microwave and antennas widely used with the radar with the communication application. The basic principle of the operation microwave and antennas are similar to the antennas with the lower, free, lower frequencies. You might want to review the principles presented with the Navy in each module 10, introduction to wave propagation, transmission lines, and antennas. At this time, particular, um, pay particular attention to the basic of the antenna of the principle of the chapter 4 with the view of the magnet, microwave and antennas. Antennas are designed with the radiated electro electromagnetic energy and display with the character of the transmitting the receiving of the antennas are some, um, similar. And are so good that transmitting antennas are often good receiving the antenna. The signal antenna performs both uh, functions of modern application. Antenna characteristics: extent the operation principle of the low frequency microwave the antennas are essentially the same with the electrical character of the very similar with the need of the fundamental knowledge of the radar communication antenna the electrical theory with the shipboard antenna maintenance of the work. Antenna theory is primarily designed for conservation anti side with the shape of the requirement to depend on the frequency the need of the brief description of antenna electrical character of the position the need of the most of the students of the electrons electronics. Antenna efficiency. Efficiency for the antenna depends on upon the ability to be coupled with the radiated energy into the air. The efficiency for the antenna is one of the which was the very little and during energy during the radiation process. The efficiency of the antenna is referred to the power gain power ratio. As compared with the standard reference of the antenna, the power gain of the antenna of the ratio of the radiated power to, is, um, to that of the reference of the antenna, which is usually a basic dipole. Both antennas refer to the fed as fed ref, radio frequency energy with the same manner, but it must be on the same principle as. Uh, same position with the energy radiated power gain and single dipole, dipole with a reflector in one in you is unity and array several disp um, dip dipole dipole same position single dipole fed with the same line power gain and more than um more than one just uh wanted to look at something real quick uh Fact of the entire transmitting and receiving the system that depends largely on um, in, in, impedance matching with the, between the um, elements of the system. Impedance matching with the particular critical of the antenna can the good impedance with the match with the maintain between the system and the antenna. Throughout the operating frequency band power transfer for the view and from the antenna, always maximum the transmission line wave guided you with the transport energy to and from uh, the antenna shift. The characteristic impedance equally the antenna. The proper impedance the most also much uh, match all 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 allows was all, all variable power to be um, absorbed and radiated by the antenna without reflection back to the line. If your transmission line or the waveguide with an independence match, mismatch at a termination, standing waves um, are set with a, up by reflection standing waves causes loss of the form and unwanted radiation loss of the transmission line arcing and wave guidelines. The standing wave ratio, abbreviated SWR, um, is, way, is way to receive, uh, way to measure for the degree of the mismatch um, between the transmission lines and its low, but the um, standing wave ratio can be expressed as a ratio of the maximum and minimum value of the current voltage and current or voltage in the standing wave that are set up with the lines of the piles. Your um, voltage standing weight, um, voltage standing weight, standing wave ratio um, is uh, voltage max over the voltage minimum. At current standing weight ratio is um, current uh, or amps max over the amps minimum. A transmission line. We have got approach with a perfectly matched condition with a standing wave ratio approach with a value with one ratio of the light a little higher than one usually acceptable practical application measurement of the standing wave ratio is only practical method of deflecting an impedance mismatch between the transmitting receiver and its antenna such as the system of the standing wave ratio is an important indication of the overall efficiency of the system during operation. The line and pins can only be used, um, used to be matched to the antenna with the one frequency, and however, the standing wave ratio will not become the, is too high with the antennas due to this over small for, um, range frequencies in the line um, match to the center of the frequency. One, two, seven, one second. Okay, all right. 
Your antenna directivity. Um, you divide by the antenna the two general clap of the directivity and omnidirectional direction. Omnidirectional antennas radiate with the receive the energy from all directions. One with the spherical wave front with the seldom need for the mounting radio system of the primary antenna that both are commonly used with the radio, radio equipment. If the uh, identification friend or foe receivers directional antenna radiated with the lobes or uh, beams that extend forward outward from the antenna in either one or two direction, radiation pattern contains a small minor lobe. These lobes are weak and normally light, have little effect on the main, main radiation pattern. Directional antennas are also receiving energy efficiently with only one two direction dependent upon whether it's unidirectional, bidirectional. Directional antennas have two characters for that important for the U and and two and radio and communication systems. One is directivity, the other is power gain. The directivity antenna refers to the nearness of the radiated beam. The beam, uh, if the bear is ne beam is narrow, at the event either both uh, either horizontal or vertical plane antenna has a high degree of the directivity of the plane. The antenna may be designed. For higher directivity and one um, only one in both planes, depending on the application of the power uh, the power game, <laughs> the power game. <laughs> power game of any antenna increases the, the um, it has the direct degree of the de and directivity increases. Cover the power is concentrated in the narrow beam, less power that is required to cover the same distance. Since microwave antennas are primarily dominantly on direction, for the, the example of the we will find you will study in the chapter of the unidirectional type. Reciprocity. Um, you need the chapter of the antenna is able is maybe able to both transmit and receive the electrical magnetic energy that's known to the reciprocate of the antenna. And reciprocate is possibly because of the antenna characteristically essential for the same, regardless of whether the antenna is transmitting or receiving the electromagnetic energy. Reciprocity almost uh, always must create our communication system to operate with only one antenna. An automatic switch called the duplex, or called the duplexer, contained with the um, either a transmitter or receiving of the antenna with the proper timing. Duplexer operation will be explained later in NEAT's module during, um, dealing with the radar communication system. To cover the reciprocity of the antenna, this chapter will discover the antennas from the viewpoint of the transmitting cycle. However, you should understand the same principles apply with the receiving cycle. Ra radar fundamentals, radio, television, radar, human eye, and the human eye have much in common because of all the process the same with the type of electrical magnetic energy. The main different, major difference between the light process by the human eye and radar frequency energy processed by the radar. Radio or radar and frequency, for example, the radar transmitter sends out for, um, signal within all directions. Signals can be detected by receivers in tune the same frequency. The radar works in some what works so much difficult and differently because of the use of the reflected energy echo instead of directly transmitted energy. The echo is related to the sound of the familiar familiar concept to move, move, most of us. Experienced person can estimate the distance, general direction of the object, causing um, a sound echo. The radar use the microwave electromagnetic energy in much of the same way. Radio transmit microwave energy with reflect the object term, um, return of the radio return of the portion of the energy is called the echo is sound of time and terminology. If you determine the direction different than the object cover the reflection determination the direction distance of the object primary function of most of the radar systems. Telescopes and radars in terms of logic, um, locating objects within space that have many of the common problems. Both of them have limited view of the both um, required geographical reference system to describe the position of the object on um, the target. The position of the object reviewed with the telescope is usually described by its relating it to a familiar object known as the position radar. Even the standard system of reference coordinate to describe the position of the object in relation to the position of the radar. Normally, the angular measurement are made up of the true north imaginary flat plane called the whole Horizontal plane angles are up over the made from, um, from the true north of the imaginary flat plane called the horizontal plane. All angles up direction measure from the secondary imaginary plane perpendicular to the horizontal plane called the vertical plane of the center corner system. If the radar location is shown in figure 3, 1 with the target um, position that will be respect with the radar and is defined in 60 degrees true, 90 degrees up, and 10 miles distance. The line directly with the radar tar is target line is called the line of sight of the distance. Um, over the point 1 to point 2 measured along the line of sight is called the target range and the angle between the horizontal plane and line of sight is called the elevation angle. Um, Elevation angle. The angle measured in the clockwise direction of horizontal plane will both be true between the true north and line of um, line of sight is known as the bearing, sometimes called the azimuth. The three conditions of the range and bearing and elevation determine the location of the target with respect to the radar. So a horizontal plane, line of sight, north, uh, north and east, 10 to 30 degrees, target range, 10 miles, vertical plane. Um, Bearing elevation angle to determine the measurement of the angle position of the radar antenna transmitted with the beam of the point directly at the target of the range is more difficult to determine because it uh, cannot directly measure the radar system than is desired to measure the range and the function of the times and speed of the electromagnetic energy. Same with the speed of the light radar is determined 
But the measuring type of the required with the pulse and energy to reach for the target of the rate term of the radar be covered with the speed of the pulse known and the two-way distance can be determined multiplying the time by the speed of the travel the total distance and the total must be divided by two but the same the one range between the time value and the initial time required for the pulse to travel to the target and return the discussion of microwave then sends in the chapter review um, requires only a base only most only the most basic understanding of the radar concepts radar fundamentals that will be discussed later in more detail later in the needs module Reflector antennas, an theoretical wave with one um, wavefront, one of the energy spreads out in all directions spread out, and travels away with the, from the antenna produce the pattern, but it is not very, very directional. Wavefront that exists only one plane does not spread because of all the wavefronts forward in the same direction for an antenna that has directed the the most chain with the normal cylindrical wavefront to the plane from wavefront. The more highly directed wavefront may and microwave the antennas play, produce the play, plane wavefront with the use of the reflector to focus on the radiator and radiated energy. Parabolic or reflectors most of the most often use the high directivity the microwave travel to sight um lots of in sight lines in sorry, my microwave travel in straight lines as do light rays. They also can be focused with the reflector just as light rays, as illustrated by antenna shown in figure three two. The microwave source is placed in a focal point at the field leaves antenna in a cylindrical wavefront at each for the wavefront reaches the reflecting surface of the phase that shifted one hundred eighty degrees. Um, each part over the sent outward and through an angle the result of in all parts field traveling in parallel path to cover the specific shape of the parabolical surface. All the path of the F of the reflector back to the line of the X Y in the same length. Therefore, when the parts of the fields are reflected with the parabolical surface to travel the X Y in the same amount of time. Three two show the parabolical radiation from the F is the um, focal point R. Um, radius one and two. Um, X is your X and Y is a um, is the is to the reflector. The dipole, you be the source of the transmission energy, will be radiated from the antenna into the space as well as the the reflector energy, which is not directed toward the paraboloid with a wide beam of the characters, which will destroy the general pattern of the parabolical reflector. However, the therm hemispherical shield, not shown, maybe you with the direct motion, mo direct most of the radiation toward the parabolical surface that prevent the destruction of the narrow pattern. Direct radiation into the space is eliminated beam and is made with a sharper, sharper and more power is concentrated in the beam without the shield. Some of the radiated field would leave the radiator directly since the Period, this part of the field that would leave the radar would not be reflected, would not become the part of the main beam, and could serve no useful purpose. In Figure Three, the radiation pattern of the paraboloid reflector contains a major lobe, several minor lobes. Major lobe is directed along the axis for the revolution. Very narrow beam so is popular with its type of the reflector. Figure Three, Four illustrate the basic parabolical, parabolical, parabolic, parabolical, para, paraboloid reflector. Our figure three three show the parabolic radiation point minor lobes major lobe axis of revolution shows the um, three four show the basic paraboloid reflector. You can see various the basic paraboloid reflector used to reduce the different beam with the shape of the because required by special application. The basic character for the most commonly used the paraboloids are um, presented in the following paragraphs. It's um, truncated paraboloid. Figure 3 5 show the truncated paraboloid, simply the reflector of the parabolic, parabolic, parabolic um, horizontal plane in the air, energy that is focused with a narrow, narrow beam. The reflector of the truncated cut is over the shortened vertical with the beam spread out the vertical instead of the becoming being focused. The van shaped beams is. Uh, is you the radar detection applicate for the accurate determination of the bearings. If the beam of it is spread vertically, it will um, detect the aircraft at different altitudes without changing the tilt of the antenna. The truncated paraboloid also works with as well as surf uh, for surfaces and such radar applications to compensate for the pitch of the roll of the ship. 3 5 through the truncated paraboloid. Um, truncated paraboloid may be used as a target for a height finding system. The reflector is rotated at 90 degrees with the shown figure 3 5 b, but the reflector is now parabolical vertical plane. The energy is you focused energy vertical in the narrow beam. The reflector is truncated or cut so that it is shortened and horizontal, but the beam will be spread out horizontally instead of the being focused, such that the fan shaped beam is we use to accurately to determine the, the elevation. Figure 3 5 b show the truncated paraboloid. Are your orange peel paraboloid in section com um, complete circular paraboloid often called the orange peel per reflector because of the orange peel shape shown on the show with the figure three six with the um, so the reflector near the beam a horizontal plane is wide with wide in the vertical plane but due to the became beam the wide is horizontal plane narrow in the vertical plane the shape of the beam is resemble the huge barrier tail. 
the microwave energy is sent into the parabolic reflector by the horn radiator, known, not, not shown with the fed, um, fed by, by a wave guide. Horn radiation pattern covered the nearly entire shape of the reflector, so almost of the microwave energy struck with the reflector. Very little escape the, as the sides antenna system. The orange peel paraboloids are often used in height finding equipment. Three six orange orange peel paraboloid cylindrical um, cylindrical para, para, paraboloid a beam radiated with an energy noticeable with a wider one cross section dimension is used another desired convert cylindrical paraboloid section with approximately rectangle 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 can be used with a figure three seven and illustrated with such an antenna and parabolic cylinder cylinder has a parabolical cross section in just one dimension that cover the reflector of the directive of the um, directive to one plane only cylindrical cylindrical paraboloid reflector is fed either by linear arrays and dipole dipoles slate inside um, side of the waveguide but or by a thin waveguide radiator it is also um, served with the focal points from the straight line rather than single focal point placing the radar radio radar radiators um, radiator or radiators along the focal point point line produce the direct medium of the energy the direct beam of the energy as the width of the parabolical section chain with the different beams should as be attained you can see the type of the antenna system you the search radar is in ground control and, and uh, GCA radar systems or ground control approach radar systems 37 and cylindrical, cylindrical paraboloid corner reflector antenna consists of the two flat conducting sheets of, the, of metal that in an, an angle for, to form a corner is shown figure 38 but the corner reflects the normal driven half wave radiator located in line which is the bisex angle from the form sheets of the reflector. 3H of the corner reflector horn radi radiators. Um, like parabolical re reflectors, you can see you can use horn radiators to obtain the directive of radiation microwaves and frequency. Because you do not use the resonant elements, horns have the advantage of being usable over the wide frequency band. Operation of the horn radio frequency radiation device is similar to the automobile horn radiation sound waves. However, the throat of the automobile automobile horn usually is sized much larger than the sound of the wavelengths with it, when it, which is used. The throat of the radio frequency radiation horn is to be comparable to the wavelength being used. Horn radars use the waveguide because of the server serve both as impedance matching device and directional radar. How horn radars are made the, um, fed by the coax and other type lines. Horn radars are constructed with a variety of shapes illustrated in the K39. The shape of the horn determines the shape of the field of the parent ratio of the horn length of the side of the mouth that determines the beam angle of the direction. In the general, the larger the mouth of the horn, the more direct the field of the pattern. Rectangular pyramidal clinical horn radars. Um, lens antenna. Lens antenna will cover the convert, um, what you can convert cylindrical radiated microwave energy into a plane. Um, wave into given direction by even the point of the source of the open over the end of the waveguide collimating lens collimating lens forms the all radio radi radial segments for the cylindrical wavefront into parallel paths the point of the source is regarded, uh, regarded as a gun which shoots the microwave energy toward the lens the point shows so the point source is often a horn radar simple dipole dipole attention diplo at attention or dipole attention or waveguide type. The waveguide type lens is sometimes referred to as the conduction type and consists of several parallel concave metal strips that which are um, placed parallel to the electrical field. The radiated energy friends um, fed to the lens is shown in figure 310 and 3B. Uh, 310B. The strips are the waveguides in parallel with the incident radiated wave. The strips are placed within slightly more than half the, wa half the wavelength apart. So the radiating source of the radial section, cylindrical waves, air medium, um, the uh, metallic medium, the collimating metallic strip. Exit side um, plane wave front directional plane wave travel. Three ten is the wave front wave guide lens. Um, three dimensional view of parallel plate lenses wave guide lens. Um, radiated energy is left and consider the infinite number of the radial sections or rays. Each of these radial sections contain a mutual perpendicular e um, electro or magnetic line, both perpendicular direction of the travel. Given each of the radial radial sections travel in a different direction, the point source of itself has poor directivity. The purpose of the lens is to convert the input of the cylindrical microwave segment in which consists of all the radial sections into parallel collimated lines for the given the direction exact side of the lens. The focusing action of the lens is accomplished with the refracting quality of the metallic strip. The collimating effect of the lens is possible because of the velocity of the electromagnetic energy propagation through the metal with a greater lead velocity through the air. Because of the concave construction of the, into the, to the lens of the lens, wave fronts arrive at the near end of the lens, travel further in the same amount of the time due as the center. Thus, the wave front emerging exists the exit side of the lens appear with the plane wave. They consist of an infinite number of the parallel section, both with the electrical field and magnetic field components, mutually perpendicular to the direction of the travel. 
delay lens. Another type of the lens with the massive of the delay electrical metallic delay lens shown in figure three eleven the delay delay, delay lens is namely namely applied to slow down um, slows down the phase pro propagation velocity as the wave the path through the lens. The delay lens is a convex constructed dielectrical material the delay in the phase of the wave um, passes through the lens and is determined by the dielectrical constant reflective in index of the material most um the case of electric artificial dielectricals consider the conducting rods and spheres that are small compared with the wavelength are you the artificial dielectrical Electricals are of the three-dimensional construction and act with the dielectrical electromagnetic wave. In this case, the inner portion of the transmitted wave is decelerated long interval over the time and the, the, uh, to the uh, time than the other uh, the outer portions. The delay causes the radiated wave to be col col collimated. All right, figure 11.3 shows the delay type lens, the plane wave front, the lens, the cylindrical wave front, the energy source feed horn, cylindrical wave front, lens, plane wave front. Um, load microwave lens, loaded microwave lens shown because 312 is a multicellular air array of thousands of cells. Each cell contains a slow wave, slow wave delayed serrated plate plastic supported wave guided element which acts as a phase control device. Loading lens can focus the microwave energy into much of the same way as the waveguide type. The reason is that the speed propagation is higher than the region between the parallel plates and the, than in free space. The parallel plates support the cells. Or right, this is called a loaded lens. Lens shown in figure 312 is an egg crate appearance because it really um, two lenses occupying the same value and the vertical plates make up the lens and the focus of the vertically polarized beam horizontal plates handle beams which are horizontally pol polarized. In other words, the type of the construction can be used in multiple beam applications where the polarization of the beams is different. Your antenna arrays. This is sharply directed. The antennas can be constructed with two or more simple half-wave di di dipole elements. They must, um, they must be positioned as over the field of the elements in some directions, cancel, um, cancel in others. Um, so, such, an set, uh, such a set of antennas is called the antenna array. With the reflectors placed behind the di dipole array of the radiation curve in one direction with a pattern similar to the one shown in figure 313. 313 shows the field pattern of the antenna array. The antenna reflector dipoles, um, minor lobe, major lobe. Um, when the encounter with the two basic types of the antenna parasitically driven the most, both times of the antenna, both antenna arrays were explained in each module, module 10, interjection wave propagation transmission lines and antennas. Only a brief re uh, review is presented in this chapter. A parabolic and reflector antenna previously discussed the antenna should be um, shown in figure 313. An example of the parabolic of the array of nodes of the electric figure 313 node directly controlled um, connected to the energy source of the direction driven the arrays in which the radiating elements are connected to the energy source have the smaller lobe of the parabolic arrays in which will retain the sum of the narrow beam character of the parasi parasitic arrays show the parabolic or reflector even the primary of the antenna's fire control radars. Others are isolation sort of microwave communication systems that require very accurate narrow beams driven arrays are even the primary in search radar antennas because their extremely narrow beams are less critical than low losses. If you position a number of driven half wave antennas elements with respect to each other to show that the energy of the individual elements will be attained added in a certain direction, cancel in other directions, then the antenna system is directional. Signal and number of different sort of sources may contribute to the source of overall effect. By the properly phasing energy fed to the antenna elements, the properly locating with the elements, you can control the direction of energy. You can also cover the energy to add the desired direction to be out of the phase and cancel the undesired direction. Drive arrays are usually made with the number of the half wave dipoles, the position phase, so that the direct desired direction pattern will be achieved. Figure 314 view A shows a simple antenna array. Consisting of two horizontal mounted elements, each of the half wave length long and head in favor of the radi resulting radiation pattern of the direction right over the angle of the plane continuing antenna conductor. Antenna um, half wave um, um, half wave lengths antenna quarter wave length quarter wave length. Show the pattern with two elements. Pattern with three elements. Um, pattern with four elements. We'll notice they have four half waves and one quarter. On the C, one quarter on three half waves and um, no ha um, quarter uh, on the antenna, um, two pa pattern with two elements. Three, four element arrays shown figure 314, B, 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 and C, respectively. The field pattern, each of the array with the with the need for the note, the note that the beam becomes um, beam becomes sharper than the norm, number of the electrons and there's still no narrow beam is desired. You may be added additional elements. Field of pattern with the intended figure uh, bidirectional and directional patterns may be obtained with a parasitic a reflector mount the roof, um, behind the driven and uh, antenna. Um, elements. 
Your bed spring array, so called because of the resemblance of the bed spring, is known as the example of the unidirectional antenna because it is a stack dipole array with the untuned reflector. The more dipole that you uh, use in a stack in one dimension horizontal, for the example, the more narrow than the beams radiated energy become within the plane. Consequently, the side of the antenna is not the same for, in all, for all installations. Antennas such as the bed spring array are commonly used with the two dimensional search radars. They obtain the rate, rate, range and beat um, bearing information over the target. This shows your bed spring antenna, um, bed spring array. Frequency sensitive is antenna. The um, radar antenna figure 316 with the feed sensation drive the horizontally stacked radar section with the radio with apply with the radio frequency pulse with the same array section will receive the target returns. Each array contains a slot because of the radio to receive the particular frequency bearing data with obtained with the mechanical rotating antenna 360 degrees elevated to the elevation data is obtained with the electronic scanning of the beam the elevation. The radar antenna the frequency sensitive Radiates the bolt to the elevating angle with the determined the, by the applied frequency. The frequency is decreased with the beam elevation, elevation and angle to decrease with the conversely. When the applied frequency is decreased with the beam elevation angle, increase with the beam elevation angle is therefore selected with the application of the frequency corresponding with the desired angle of the elevation. Physical length of the antenna's feed section, called the um, serpentine section, the figure 317, relation to the length, wavelength applied with the energy to determine the direction of the radiated beam. We must understand this more clearly if you consider how the beam is shifted. Shift the curves um, when the change of the frequency become with the pop of negative peaks of the energy arrived at the adjacent slots are made at different times. The change in field pattern is um, such that the angle that departs for the angle with the radiated beam leaves the antenna if the beam is changed. Note that the change in the phases are applied with the radio frequency energy would cause the same effect. Radio frequency sensitive antenna. This is a frequency sensitive antenna, the antenna array, the antenna pedestal. Um, Show for the radio intensity, radio frequency is um, feed to the absorption load, um, horizontal slotted linear array, absorption load, serpentine feed assembly. The slot antenna exhibits, may, um, exhibits many of the character of the conventional dipole antenna when the arranged arrays of the higher degree directly can be obtained. All the beam, also, the beam can be caused to scan a volume space by changing either the frequency or phase of the energy driven in the antenna elements. The basic slot antenna is a complementary and its complementary dipole. The slot antenna consists of the radar form of the, by cutting narrow slots of large metal surfaces. The uh, such of the antenna shown figure 318, the slot length of the half wavelength, half wavelength length desired frequency, and the width of the small fraction of wavelength. The antenna is frequently compared with the conventional half wave dipole, consisting two half flat metal strips. The physical dimension of the metal strips are such that they would fit in the slot cut with the large metal sheet. Type of the antenna complementary dipole. Our slide antenna shows the half wave length, length large metal sheet. It's cut in um, complementary, complementary dipole, half wave length, wave length, cut in the middle, um, and complementary dipole. Um, the slot antenna is compared with the complementary dipole to illustrate the radiation part of the produce. The slot antenna cut into the infinite large metal sheet, but they're also, um, the, the complementary dipole the antenna are the same. Several important differences exist between the slot antenna and the complementary antenna. The first of the electrical magnet fields are interchanged. Um, in the case of the dipole antenna shown figure 318, the electrical lines um, of the horizontal with the magnet lines form the um, loops of the vertical plane. The slot with the antenna the magnet is lined with the horizontal electrical lines or vertical electrical lines are built up the crop of the narrow dimension of the slot. As a result, the polarization radiation produces horizontal slot, vertical, the vertical slot is you with the polarization horizontal. Second difference between the slot of the antenna complementary dipole is the direction of line of the electromagnetic force ab abruptly reverse one side metal sheet over the other. In this case, the dipole electrical lines have the same direction with the given magnetic lines form the continuous closed loops. All right, the energy of the supply of the slot antenna current, current flow over the metal sheet, but the current is not combined with the edge of the slot, but rather than the spread of the overall sheet. Um, the radiation that takes place from the bolt at the side of the sheet of the cape, the complementary dipole, however, the currents are not combined, are more combined so that the more gradient magnitude of the current is required to produce the given output with the causing the using the dipole antenna, the current distribution of the dipole resemble the voltage distribution of the slot. The edges of the slot will have voltage concentration relatively low current distribution. The complementary dipole has a high current concentration and relatively low voltage. Slot antennas are adaptable to um, of the very high frequency, ultra high frequency ranges. One of the practical advantages is that the fed section energies of the slot may be below the large metal surface in which the slot is covered. Nothing needs to extend from the surface. In addition, the slot itself 
may be covered by the section of the insulating material that provides the shield of the antenna can be pressurized by dry air. Dry air pressurization reduces the moisture of the waveguide and prevents arcing. Many of the new radar systems teach reaching the fleet over the next few years use, will use frequency or phase sensitive antennas. Some of the new radars you will use the antennas that electrically scan azimuth and was well as elevation, eliminating the moving uh, moving antenna. Chapter 3, Summary.